Hello, my name is Maz Songarwala, and I lead Application Services Excellence here at Oracle. This group encompasses customer support and customer success across Oracle's applications portfolio. It was recently formed and integrated with our applications development organization here at the company. We did this to bring together all of the capabilities and elements of customer experience in one place, under one umbrella, to ensure a seamless and friction-free experience for our clients. We did this in one organization to eliminate potential silos, converge around common goals and objectives, and also streamline operational processes. We're seeing the positive impacts of this already, with record numbers of customers successfully going live and realizing value with their Oracle applications investments. A lot of customers ask me, what do you mean when you say you have a customer-first mindset? After all, a lot of technology companies say they're customer-centric. To us, it's really about the entire experience across the entire life cycle. What does that mean? From a customer standpoint, if you're using the application and have a simple question, please don't make me actually have to leave your application to get an answer to that simple question. Make your products easy to use and more intuitive. If the product can't answer this question for me, make it so that I can get the answer quickly by surfacing useful content in a self-service manner quickly. For us, that means really working and ensuring that our help is available across multiple digital platforms. When I do have to talk to somebody at Oracle, please make sure that I can get to the right person who has the right skills as fast as possible. For us, that means shielding you from all of the inner workings and the operational processes to ensure that that occurs. And finally, when you've helped me with my issue or answered my question, don't just let me go on with my day. Help me understand where I could get better. Are there best practices that I could be looking at? And for us, that's about continuity of experience. So it's with these design principles in mind, it's shaping everything we do and everything we're investing in. And with those principles in mind, we believe we are driving a customer-centric model from onboarding and readiness, through implementation and go-live, through business continuity and value realization. So let's talk about some concrete examples. Every customer, as part of their subscription, is assigned an implementation support team to work with your implementation team and those of your chosen systems integrator to ensure project success. This team is headed up by an implementation support lead and augmented by product support experts to work with your implementation team by managing your service requests, reviewing your project milestones, ensuring any blockers to those milestones are addressed in a timely manner, and act as escalation points. This team stays with you through your successful go live and only rolls off after you've been able to run your critical business processes in the cloud successfully. But it doesn't stop there. Post go live, we monitor your environment to ensure that A, you're staying at a state where you needed to be, but at times where things may result in a flurry of activities that may indicate that you may be in a non-healthy state, we assign a product expert to work with your teams to get you back to that stable state. This can happen when you have things like mergers and acquisitions or divestitures. So you've heard me describe what our experience is from a support standpoint across the life cycle. Let's make it real. We've had record number of customers, as I mentioned, go live over the last several quarters. In each of these instances, we've learned what works and what doesn't. That level of expertise is brought to bear on each of these implementation support teams. Things like, is an operational readiness plan in place post go live? What is the change management plan for your users? Are you ready with a dress rehearsal for a go live before you actually go through your go live? And are all issues addressed before we actually get to the big event? In most of these cases, our customers are seeking our counsel on what works best based on the experience we have with the thousands of customers we serve. Similarly, the last several quarters during the pandemic has seen a lot of customers start using new functionality or functionality that existed already to ensure that their business stays nimble and agile. They come to us for help in understanding how best to implement, how best to configure, how best to set that, turn on this functionality to enable their business. Through this, we want to get into a much more advisory state with our clients and move away from just being take a case, close a case, move on to the next case. Again, aligned to your overall success, enabling your overall objectives. By taking this high-touch approach, 
We believe that we're accelerating our transformation from transactionally supporting our customers to one which is much more proactive and aligned to your journey. This is all backed up with our robust Cloud Customer Connect community, where hundreds of thousands of members are engaging and collaborating with tens of thousands of discussion groups so that you can share best practices and maximize the value of your SaaS investment. For the future, we're investing heavily in critical business process monitoring for things like your monthly closure of the books or payroll. This will allow us to take a predictive and proactive approach to mitigating issues before you even notice them. Similarly, we're also investing heavily in automation, where as you're telling us about a particular issue through the support experience, we're scanning for patterns and anomalies to make sure that we can either speed time to resolution or address issues before they even occur in your environment. These are just a couple of examples where we believe that we're driving a much different customer experience and one which is aligned to your business objectives. To summarize, we made some big, bold moves here, both organizationally and strategy-wise, to ensure that we really fulfill our aspirations of being a customer-centric organization. As with anything, this is an ever-evolving aspiration, and we're committed to take our customers' feedback to deliver what will truly be an excellent service experience. Thank you so much. My team and myself look forward to working with you as you embark on your cloud journey or are realizing value with what you've already achieved. Thank you so much.